J.G. Thomson took science to new heights with his 1897 discovery of the electron, the first subatomic particle. He also found the first evidence that stable elements can exist as isotopes and invented one of the most powerful tools in analytical chemistry, the mass spectrometer. Joseph John Thomson was born on December 18, 1856 in Manchester, England, UK. His father, Joseph James Johnson, ran a specialist bookshop that had been in his family for three generations. His mother, Emma Swindles, came from a family that owned a cotton company. Even as a young boy, Joey Wood would later be son known as JJ was deeply interested in science. At age 16, he became a student at Oons College, the University of Manchester, where he studied mathematics, physics and engineering. A shy boy is a parents hoped he would become an apprentice engineer with the locomotive company. These hopes were dashed with the death of his father when JJ was 16. The fees for engineering apprenticeships were high and his mother could not afford them. The misfortune ultimately benefited science because JJ needed to find funding to continue his education. In 1876, age 19, he won the funding not in engineering but in mathematics at the University of Cambridge. 4 years later, he graduated with high honors. Thomson devised better equipment and mothers than had been a use for before. When he passed the rays through the vacuum, he also measures the angle at which they were deflected and calculated the ratio electrical charge to the mass of the particle. He discovered that the ratio was the same regardless of what type of gas was used. which led him to conclude that the particles that made up the gas were universal. Thomson continued studying at Cambridge and in 1882 he won the Adams Prize, one of the university's most sought after mathematics awards. In 1883 he earned a master degree in mathematics. JJ Thomson is a name that will always be connected with the discovery of the electron. In 1890 he married Rose Elizabeth, daughter of Sir George that had once now Sir George Packer Thomson. a professor of physics at London University who was awarded the Nobel Prize for Physics in 1937 and one doctor he died in Cambridge on August 30 1940 and is buried in Westminster Abbey near two other influential scientists Isaac Newton and Charles Darwin Thomson had the insight to understand the run of experiments that were required to pin down the particular natural of electricity The chain of investigation linking one generation of scientists with the next is important but generally overlook characteristics of the scientific method thank you thanks for watching see you on next video